Right, so here we are at the messy side of the shed. Yes, the messy. This is the this is the sort of like the DIY side, but it's not really because I don't do a lot of DIY because I'm not very good at it. But uh, before we start on that stack over there, I just thought I'd show you. I found these. I haven't included them in that stack really, but I just thought I'd show them. Uh, there was there's six of these. Was there six? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, six of these. A series of, uh, <laughs> I think you find this quite funny, how to listen to music. And yes, I know, I can imagine the comments coming out now. You should listen to all those. Yes, indeed, I probably should, actually. And I'm going to I'm gonna have a little listen, just to see how interesting they are. As I say, there was a stack of six, six of them. And uh, they're all the same, like part one, part two. The International Educational Society. Um... Uh, Columbia Gramophone Company, How to Listen to Music, number th this is number three, but it's obviously there's, uh, there's probably 12, there's, there's six of them, so 12, 12 parts. It's going to take me a while to get through, isn't it? Anyway, I'll put these, I'll leave these down here. Now, we're not going to have any rejects as such, we're going to have listens to's and that, um, unless, unless they are artists and uh, tenors and uh, baritones and things like that and then they'll go in the reject <laughs> anyway let's get moving uh so the first one is on a deco label and oh i'm spending christmas with the old feeling is it the old feeling or the old folks no the old folks old feeling indeed old folks there yeah, i hope you can see this these these labels well i have set it up and uh, love is all that's vera lynn oh, i'm not gonna put it on the list i'll put it on the listen to paul I'm not over, I'm not a big fan of Vera Lynn's. I do some of the stuff I like of hers, but generally I'm not an overly big fan. But I'll listen. Oh, the winner label. Oh, wow. Robert Carr, The Song of the Wagoner. This is an oldie. And Captain Mac. Better go and listen to, isn't it? I have a, I have a subscriber who's doing me a big favour at the moment. He's repairing a gramophone. Uh, a sound box for me uh, a 5b um, and um, and he's interested in old really old um, uh, uh, 78 so he has he's got first dibs on them because he's doing me such a big favor so uh, I, I'll put that aside for him I've got quite a few to put aside for him actually <laughs> I'll have to uh, get them sorted out for him oh another Vera Lynn here maybe and on the other side is they'll come another day still looking for that uh, famous one of hers we'll, we'll put it on the listen to pile but i i don't think i'll be keeping it somehow um regal happy go lucky you and broken hearted me by the london piano oh dear accordion band it doesn't get worse than that for me because i just don't like uh, um accordion bands or pianos that much well depending on who's playing them obviously um oh did you like me um I did forgot to mention it, didn't I? Did you like me? I'm taking it off now because it doesn't fit that well and it's starting to hurt my head. <laughs> oh, that's better. Um, no, I'm rejecting that one. I don't like. I don't like that sort of stuff. I'm, I just, that's not me. So, oh, another Xonophone record. The bee and the butterfly. Oh, the bee and the butterfly. Oh, I think I know this one. Albert Whelan. Is it the bee and the butterfly? Oh, and the three trees. I'm going to listen to that one. I'm going to listen to that one. Ah, right, what have we got now? Oh, oh, Columbia. Amundo Ross and his band. Oh, I don't know if I'm going to like that at all. Amundo Ross and his orchestra. Hot Potato Mambo. I don't know what might be interesting. That. I'm going to listen to that. Brunswick. Oh, come on, please let there be a great Brunswick here. Swanee by Al Jolson. I've got it. But, and April showers, I love April showers as well, so that's a real great double for me. Definitely keeping that. If there any uh, thing that's definitely going on the keep, uh, I think it might be a copy. I've got one, I've got a copy of it already, but uh, if not, I'm already, I'm trying to um, sort out a load of um, spares that I've got and that to put to one side to send some to a friend as well. Uh, so, uh, we'll see, that might be one. Leslie Stewart Memories. G. H. Elliot, the original chocolate coloured. Oh dear. <laughs> I'm afraid it's very unpolitically correct, that one. 
um, on this Edison Bell winner gold label and Leslie Stewart memories again uh, it's a bit uh, I, 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 I'm tempted to want to listen to it I'm not sure if I will listen to it a thing but uh, maybe I will I don't know we'll see um, it's on a phone label again another old one singing a vagabond song actually it's not that oldest on a phone I don't think well it is but it's not to uh, Singing a Vagabond Song is Norman Blair. So is that some sort of comedian? And should I? No, you shouldn't. But we'll put it on the listen to pile. We'll put it on the listen to pile. That's strange, isn't it? I was thinking about that other record and that, and the <laughs> title comes up, should I? Uh, Joy Dance, Banjo Solo. A banjo. Ooh, banjo, banjo. Can be quite good, the banjo, can't it, really? Oh, it's on, on the listen to pile. Oh, an Edison record here. Edison Bell, winner. Student song, part one. So I assume it's part two on the other side, which it is. There we go. Oh, I'm going to have to put on the listen to pile, isn't I? And we're going to have some late night listings coming up. The only reason I haven't done any lately is not because I've run out of stuff to, to listen to. I've got quite a lot of stuff to listen to. It's just that I haven't been in the mood and uh, one thing or another has stopped me from doing it. But I will get my bottom into gear and uh, and start doing them again. Broadcast 12 here is Leslie Stewart's Songs. Oh, it's uh, it's uh, the band of the HM of Lifeguards. <sighs> Not really. Leslie Stewart's Songs. Oh, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. What do you think? The Broadcast 12, an interesting... Oh, I, I'm always interested in these ones. That's a nice condition as well. Yeah. Okay. We'll, we'll put it on the listen to pile and blimey. <laughs> um, the kilters, the kilties. Uh, characterist, characteristic teak or something. Banjo solo again. There we go. I'll show you it. I should be showing you. Shouldn't I? I shouldn't be. I'm getting carried away. Return of the regiment. Uh, I don't know about this. I don't know, but I'm going to listen. I'm going to do a quick now. These will probably be really quick listens to, you know, drop the needle on, listen to a few seconds. If I don't like it, off it goes and in a reject. And they, all the my rejects always go to other collectors. So I, I try to, I try to sort of, I'll try to find collectors who, who really uh, want these and that. And hopefully pretty local too. <laughs> As I'm not really, oh. Vocalion, Spring Song, Lionel Tertis, 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 Violin Solo, mm. yes, indeed, I'm not sure about this one, what do you think guys, I think, I don't know, I don't know, I think, I think it's going to go underneath, in the reject, and underneath now is reject, I've got an underneath bit, let's reject, Boom. underneath, there it goes, what we got here? Oh, the Woodchopper's song by Joe Loss. I don't mind Joe Loss on this particular one because on the other side is in the mood, and I know that is that was a big hit of his, and that actually is a great version. It's an up-tempo version of Glenn Miller's. So that's on the keep, and I have got a copy of this, so that will be going on my uh, in a pile of, um, as I've already said, in a pile of uh, copies I've got somewhere along the way. Nat King Cole. Mm, now. The quality is not that good. You can see there's some wear to this. So I know I like Nat King Cole. I love Nat King Cole. I'm not going to keep it because it is not in great condition. And I think you've got to have a really nice condition, uh, uh, 78, if it's going to be Nat King Cole. What have we got here now? Bing and Gary Crosby. Got quite a few Bing Crosbys and that, but not with Gary. Uh, gone fishing. It, oh, Louis Armstrong. I've got this one. I've got it. I've got it. Again, it's a little bit worn condition, but it's a spare, so I'll put it on the spare list. It might need to be dewarped a bit, I think. You get that, don't you? Uh, the Andrew Sisters. Ooh, Red River Valley. I like an Andrew Sisters. Some of them, anyway. So I shall be keeping this one. I see. Shall I keep? Yeah, I will keep it, I think. I will keep it. Uh, the glow worm spike jones wow spike jones 
and uh, Libestrium, is it something on the other side? Uh, Spike Jones and that. Now I've got a collection of Spike Jones. Some of them I like, some of them I'm not so keen on. But I will keep it and add it to the collection for the moment. Uh, how about you? Ambrose and his orchestra. Wow, on the Decca label. And he stole my heart away. That is a definite keep. That is a definite keep. Right, so these are the ones so far. I think we no, yep. These are the, the there's a few here that I haven't got any covers for, so yes. So anyway, we'll move. What have we got here? Oh, we're seeing House of Music. Oh, I've got Columbia, The Cat and the Fiddle by Savoy Hotel or Fiends. Ah, oh. hmm, The Cat and the Fiddle. Try to forget Foxtrot. Yes, it is. That could be quite good, couldn't it? And it's in nice condition. Look at that. It's a shiny one. Yeah, a little bit of marking there. It looks like a watermark. Or something. No, it's a scuff running across there. But other than that, it's not in too bad condition. Yeah, so we'll we'll have to, uh, we'll keep that. Uh, actually, put it on the listen to, Carl, because I think it might be an interesting one to listen to. Now, what we've got... Oh, look at this. <laughs> an Imperial. Oh, no! Hawaiian some lumber time, slumber time. <laughs> I don't like Hawaiian style music. I don't. Hawaiian guitars, it says, in a little Spanish town. And I really am not keen on on the on on the, on the twanging of Hawaiian guitars at all. So I'm gonna put it. Ooh, I'm gonna I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna reject Paul for the moment. Now I know a lot of people were. We're quite interested in these uh, so so I, I haven't looked at any of these so i don't really know what's on them uh, or any of these i i, I put I, very very difficult for me to do this but i put them in the shed and i wait until i've got the camera on and then i sort through them so uh what have we got here a godson goodson sorry godson goodson record yeah, here we go. Get back enough for you there. And uh, the titles are right on the top here, aren't they? Yeah, so we've got Sunny Boy here. Uh, who is it by? I don't know. I should put my reading glasses on. I've got some reading glasses here. It might help, actually. Let me see if that helps. Oh, right. Uh, yeah, Sunny Boy. Um, and When We're Together was on the other side. There we go. Um, who is it by? Marathon Dancer Orchestra. With vocal chorus. There you go. That's the first one. Definitely on the keep pile. We'll have to try and sort these out because they look a little bit bent to me. <laughs> and I think we need to try and do something with that. So has anyone got any ideas of how you can flatten these out? I don't know. They'll play on the gramophone player. I know that because I've got a big one of these somewhere. Um, I can't do without you. And when we're apart by Fred Hall and his orchestra. There we go. The next one is She's the Sweetest Kid and Broken Hearted by Fred Hall again and his orchestra. And these have vocal chorus as well. A little bit of a mouse has been at that one by the looks of it, but it's, no, it's okay. It's okay. Uh, and this one is You've got, got That Certain Something and Let's Pretend. Oh, get you on there. There we go. And it's by the California Dance Orchestra as well. So that's uh, yeah. So we have these here, and these uh, I'm not taking these out, so I'll take them out and have a look. Oh, see what we got. Oh, just quick go through this. Columbia, the house that Jack built. My heart is saying the four bright sparks. Hmm, lovable and sweet. Vocal by Billy Milton. I've not heard of him, to be honest. Deco label, eh? What have we got? Bob Malin. When the sun says good, uh, good night to the mountain, is it? Nobody's, nobody's can't, uh, darling but mine. Nobody's darling but mine. Bob Malin. Never heard of him. Vocal with guitar accompaniment. Mm. 
I'll put it on the listen to pile. Brunswick. Oh, that'd be a good one. I like Brunswick's. The Last Rose of Summer. Uh, Dina, Diana, Diana Dob, Dob, Durbin. Is it Diana? Diana Durbin. Because. There we go. Sorry. There we are. He's a bit bent as well. Uh, well, smart girls grow up, blah, blah, blah. No, I don't know about that one, but I'll put it on the listen to. Regal, what we got? Two Leslies, so handsome. And on the other side is Down Upon the Farm. Hmm. <sighs> listen to, pal, I suppose. <laughs> oh, dear. I'm going to have a few to get through here, aren't I? My heart is an open book, the Casa Loma Orchestra. And here comes Cookie. Is it Cookie? It looks like Cookie. Hmm. Let's just have a break for a sec. Right. Welcome back. That wasn't long, was it? <laughs> the magic of video, eh? Um, right, so we've got a few left there. Um... Nothing's come up really well. I mean, these obviously are really interesting. Um, there's an Ambrose and that, and uh, Andrew's sisters. Mm, you know, I don't mind. Gone fishing is a copy I've got, so I'm still waiting for that, you know. <laughs> but here we are, the broadcast label. Oh, what's on here? Um, Gypsy Melody, Al Benny's Broadway Boys. And on the other side is uh, say a little prayer for me. Uh, mm, well, put that on the uh, listen to poll. Someone else, not me. Pee Wee Hunt and his orchestra. This is a 50s capital label. 12th Street Rag. Mm, it's modern, but, but it's modern for what I usually listen to, you see. Or Callion. Or. Put the pipe down. <laughs> Toy trumpet. Horace head it. He he'd hide it. Hide hit. He'd hide. I don't know. And his brigadiers. And on the other side is tippy tur tippy tur or something. Tippy t tippy tur. I don't know. Here we go. Swing series. So it's got to be pretty good, I would imagine. So I'm going to put it on the listen to pal. Brunswick. Oh, what we got here? Till then. Oh, the Mills Brothers. No over keen on the Mills Brothers. You always hurt the one you love. Mm. Mm, no, no, I'm going to put it on the reject pile because I'm not a fan of the uh, Mills Brothers. Oh, on the winner here is At the Top of the Hill by Stanley Kirkby. And on the other side is Blue Bird, Stanley Kirkby. Mm, there's an X on that side. I wonder why. <laughs> is that the good side? I'll put it on the listen to pile. I think that will go to somebody, as I've already said. Another winner one here. The Maid of the Mountains, Band of... Oh, no. No, 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 no. Band of His Majesty's Irish Guards, Maid of the Mountains. Mm, well, that, that, will, that, will, that will go along with somebody else's, like I said, in the reject pile there, but... Uh, Regal. The Lancashire Romeo. Oh, George Formby. What's on the other side? Imagine me in the match. Oh, great. This is brilliant. I've been after this one. I've got a collection of about full 50, 40 or 50 uh, George Formbys. And this one I haven't got. And this is one that I've actually got a search for on eBay. Oh, brilliant. I, I'm really, 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 really happy about getting this one. So, wow. This definitely is a keep. So there. I've got one that I've really been after. That's fantastic. Whoa. Uh, Decker. America Calling by the uh, Carlisle Cousins. America Calling continued. Don't understand. I don't know if I know this. I don't know this one, do I? Uh, I'll put it on the listen to part, I think. Brunswick. What we got? Back in your own. Back in your own 
backyard Al Jolson. Another Al Jolson. To 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 see. I've got this one. Um. So it's a it's a a, a, a copy. I've got now. On the keep. On the regal is in the eyes of the world your mind by Eric Randolph, a tenor. Yuck. <laughs> I'll take you home again. Pal of mine. Oh. Mm, reject pile. Reject pile. And it's going to go off to someone else. Uh, what we got here? International Xonophone Company Zampa. Uh, by the Xonophone Military Band. And it's, oh, it's a single cider. It's a single cider. Wow. I don't think I've got a single cider. What's it got on here? Oh, it's got something on here. Somebody's written on this. Speed, 76. There we go. Can you? I don't know if you guys can see this. I don't know. I'll try and get it into the light. Somebody's written. There we are. Speed, 76. Hmm. Interesting. Of course, there, there was a lot of early ones were all over the place with speed, weren't they? I think it was not until 1920, was it two or something like that? And then they, they managed to uh, uh, get it all... Um, Unified to a 78. Last one, Xonophone label, when mother played the organ. Mm. And on the other side is uh, Passion Flower. Terence McGovern's International Accordion Band. Oh no! Not accordion. There's a hymn now, I think, or something. No, it's going to read Jet Pile. Right, so that's it for this uh, for this one. Hopefully we'll find something um maybe something really really exciting for you guys I, 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 i'm certainly happy with with this selection here and i've got some nice little ones here to listen to and we'll see what we got there might find something in there that's really really cool but thank you for watching this uh i'm gonna start my pipe up again and uh, i'll catch you guys later in the next one don't forget to like and uh subscribe if you want to see some more of uh, my 70 or my 78s bye for now